Sirens, sirens, and more sirens. That's all you hear in the city. I didn't plan this, by the way. All right, this is the second part of a three-part series. And uh, I guess you could say tonight, since it's dark outside, we're going to talk on platoons. And platoons are six troops put together to form 49 people, because you got, uh, you see all these groups around here, seven, 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 seven and, and seven. And there'd be another group, another troop in the center, there'd be 49 plus one. That's your 50, right? And uh, so this is just a larger version take off of the first, instead of having one person out here, instead of Joe being out there, this is his group. This is Joe's group. This is Kathy's group. This is Paul, uh, Paul's group. And this is, this is Bonnie's group, right? All right, and they're all working together. They're all being more specific. Uh, maybe Paul over here, He's working with the group next to him on design application. One person's one group is working on, on the heating applications, another is working on, on the best way to, to build a simple stove. And over here, you might have uh, this group here, they would be experimenting on the right lengths of pipes. You might be trying different lengths of pipes to uh, discover the, the hidden properties was this the Joe pipe does work on resonant frequency like a pipe organ right so they're they're the ones behind tuning the project and over here you got a group this group over there is working on the uh, trying different fuels trying HHO or, or hydroxy and uh, hydrogen to see if this is going to have an effect an enhanced effect or not, whether it's going to speed up the cavitation of the pipes or or maybe have more of a, a vortex effect. And, and that's why you have this group here. These are people that, that work in the music industry. They know how to measure sound. They know how to understand it when they plug it into a computer. So they can actually measure the different harmonics that's coming off the pipes. And by that, the the work can be fast-tracked. There won't be too much guessing around here. So you have these six groups of people working together, and in the center you have your your administration, so they're going to be busy working and, and coordinating with all these six other platoons around, or troops around them, right? And uh, so they won't actually have their, be getting their their hands wet in this stuff, but they'll have an understanding exactly what's going down. They'll be the more or less the, the head, and this is your, your your body. So your head and body, they need to work together. So their position might be to get the information out, to, to give away maybe CDs. You also have this troop over there. Maybe what they're good at is is making t-shirts. You now there's a lot of money that can be made from you know, making t-shirts saying uh, Joe Pipe Tech you know, with, a, with uh, maybe a little bit of fire on it, you know, this stuff doesn't make fire. Hats, you can have hats with the same thing. There's no law saying that you can't. And, and, and the kids would love it because it's new, it's innovative. There's nothing like this out in, in America, I'm telling you. This is something that everybody can participate in, right? So you have the head working together with the body. You have 49 people all together plus one. That will be the voice for this particular battalion, right? Or not battalion, a tune of people. I'm getting too big here. 
So the next, the third portion, third video, we'll be talking about how six platoons, not seven this time, but six, can be put together to form a, a company. This is a company, a company of six platoons, and in the center, uh, instead of having uh, a seventh, you would simply have a website that would more or less tie everything together. This is this is very basic. This is a better strategy than than ML, you know, multi-level marketing because everybody's involved it's, and it's all, all grassroots. And it takes people together uh, being on the same page, having the same mind, and being of one accord for, for it to work. And the bottom line is it's not making money. The bottom line is, is helping people and knowing that the times are coming where this simple technology is going to allow many families across Canada and across America to have their freedom because we can, you know, if you take an honest look at the cities, we are fast losing our freedom because we have neglected to make God first and foremost in our nation. America was founded on godly principles, but after all these hundreds of years we forgot. Now there is a price to pay and God is beginning to shake and he will shake until everything can be shaken, will be shaken. And if we don't repent, we will see our, our nations go into oblivion, just like the all past civilizations. They forgot God and they ended up disappearing into history, right? Again, I give you guys a welcome to Joe Pipe Tech, Joe underscore Pipe underscore Tech, uh, Yahoo Groups. And I have absolutely the, the faith that all this is going to come together. I don't have any doubt. So I know it's God's time and that in a short season of time, years of work can be reduced down to a couple months, maybe two or three months. And uh, to where, uh, well, I'm also putting the word out now that I'm looking also at some future point for a thousand people. For a thousand people who have shops across Canada and the United States who can start making this stuff and getting it out to the people, uh, not into the public mainstream of society. There's going to be a lot of people wanting to have one of these different emergency, emergency devices, you know, stoves and heaters on hand just in case. So, like the demand is there. So I'm just creating uh, the means in which to meet the demand. All right, uh, this is the third presentation. I hope that you enjoy it.